everyone, it's Jenny, and today I'm doing my makeup of the week. I know I'm a little late this week putting this out because I actually forgot to film it. So there you go, there you have it. So, let's get into and see all the makeup goodies that I'm uh, wearing for this week. So, I know I usually have my usual, so I, I try to leave those out. That way, you know, saves time and you know that's what I usually use. Um, so, to start off with priming, I'm using the Revlon um, Brightening Primer. I like this primer a lot. Um, I'm not sure though with this foundation I'm using or if it's the moisturizer I'm, I'm using, but I'm getting a little bit of flakiness. Um, so, I'm not sure if it's this or if it's something else. Um, but I know when I originally tried the, the primer, I really liked it. So, um, and next up. A foundation is the Maybelline Fit Me. This is the Dewy and Smooth, which I'm wearing this now. I know I look a little bit like I need to, to powder just a tad. Um, I do like this formula. I'm wearing 115 Ivory. Um, I think this has got a little bit of a pink um, undertone to it, so I may need to try to get a different shade, uh, but you know, I make it work. And then for um, powder. I've actually been using this highlight and contour palette by IBY Beauty. So I've actually been using this to, um, of course, powder a little bit and set my under eye and also to contour bronze up my face a little bit. More bronze up my face um, just because sometimes my face comes off really pale and sometimes when I'm sick with a headache, I get really pale and people are like, are you okay? Are you sick? But this has been pretty good. Uh, let's see. I didn't tell you what concealer I was using. What concealer am I using? I should know this. Um, yes. It's the uh, Kat Von D, um, the Locket Concealer. This is in the shade L3 Warm. Um, I like it. This is just a really, really thick concealer. Um, so a little goes a long way for me because it is, I mean, super thick. Like I wouldn't want to put this all up and down under my eye. There's just no way because I have little fine lines under there and every concealer, I mean, every concealer I've tried creases up a little bit. That's just for me. But I do like it. It does, you know, cover up what I need to cover up. Uh, blush wise, I've actually been using two blushes this week. One is I got an uh, I got an Etsy. It's the Hikari blush. Um, let me see if I can swatch this for you. I know I haven't really swatched anything, and it kind of comes off as this is what it looks like because it's supposed to be like like a bronzer and blush. Um, I think it's pretty. I think it's a little bit patchy though, to be perfectly honest. And then of course the Revlon, the um, Insta blush. This stuff's amazing. Um, super easy to blend. So I really really like it. Um, highlight, I have been using the Kylie Pressed Illuminating Powder in Strawberry Shortcake. And this is what it looks like. It does have a mirror with it, which is nice. Um, not my favorite highlighting shade, um, but it's still alright. Um, it's sort of I would thought I would think that it would have more of a pink tone to it, but it's got more of a gold. Like this is it right here. Um, but it's I mean it's not bad. The bestie actually gave that to me, so I can't complain. It was free. Um, let's see what else is in here. Um, of course, I always have this um, and the Give Me Brow. Um, I'm not trying any other eye pencils, so you know. And of course, my uh, Benefit, the Erase Paste, and the uh, Boing. So. That same old, same old. Um, using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. I think I've had this on here before. I wear that a lot. Um, let's get into the makeup palettes. I'm actually doing two uh, Urban Decay. This is the Naked uh, Urban Decay uh, Urban Addictions. And then I'm also doing the Naked Palette. This is the um, Addictions. And I think Sephora had this, and I love it. It's just, I love doing like pinks and purple, so this is perfect. And then I have a little, there's a, like a, it's like a dark, dark brown and a white shade, so you can, you know, 
play around with that. And then of course the classic, the uh, Naked One, which is just a great palette. Um, I think if anybody's getting into makeup, this would probably be a good palette to start with. Um, I love it. I love the feel of it. Um, love the shadows in it. They're really, really good. Um, so yeah, I could just go on and on and on. And um, eyeliners, I'm actually using a couple different eyeliners. The Ciate London eyeliner that has a little brush on the end. It's just, you know, regular eyeliner. And then I'm using um, the Marc Jacobs, because sometimes I like a brown um, in my waterline. Uh, the Marc Jacobs, this is in, what color are you in? Earthquake. It's got earth in parentheses. And then this, the pink of me, I like wearing in my waterline as well, too. Um, they're both um, very, very pigmented and very, very smooth. So these are really, really good. And, uh, of course, I got my Kat Von D um, Trooper Liner. And mascara, I'm using the Voluminous Primer along with the Superhero, which when I tried the Superhero Mascara, I hated it. Um, but um, I had gotten an Ipsy, didn't like it. I was like, this stuff is overrated. What's people going on about? But then I got it in my Sephora Play. And I'm not sure if maybe one was just too dried out or maybe I just got a bad one. I'm not sure, but I'm really, really liking it. I think it's pretty good. So, um, that's everything for my makeup of the week. What are you using makeup wise? Do you have favorites that you always stick with or do you try to change things up? Um, it's just kind of interesting because I know my sister likes to stick to, she likes to use new makeup, but she likes to stick to her, what she knows. Uh, but me, I kind of like to just every week do something different, use something different. Because my opinions on the product seems to change. Because sometimes, like with this primer, I'm not sure if it's the primer, the moisturizer, or the foundation I'm using that's causing me to, to have my little, you know, where it's like bobbling up. So, I don't know. So let me know that you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I'd love to have you here. I love to talk about makeup, beauty products, all that good stuff. And with that, have a fabulous day. Bye.